Hello everybody, it's me, Sambellas. Yes, I have changed my username back to Sambellas because, you know, that name really carried a lot of significance for me and I just decided, you know, screw the Bella place. I'm just gonna bring it back to Sambellas. But anyway, that's not important right now. The important thing is we're doing another Tiny Town episode today. Now, I have posted the last episode on this about two months ago and, you know, I'm so guilty of that. I'm so sorry for not finishing the Tiny Town Let's Play, but I promise you, for those who are still interested in tiny town that I will finish this let's play. So I have played a little bit off camera with his house. I think the house looks much better than it did before. I sadly do not have any before and after pictures but yeah this is how far we are. All right I'm actually kind of excited to continue this. I do actually have a massive reason for not continuing this let's play but you know that is not important either. Point stays. We gotta finish this little tiny town. All right so here is is Ziggy. We are basically on the second part of Ziggy and yes Ziggy has a cat. That is one thing I got him off camera. Now there was a comment. I cannot precisely remember who it was. Thank you for the suggestion of getting a cat. Now the cats they go into these bushes, these poohoo bushes and they get feathers for you and you can sell the feathers for a bunch of money and that's gonna help a lot with Ziggy's progress. All right so all we need to really finish up here is their bathroom, the bedroom and the rest of the kitchen and the living room area all right so ziggy wiggy let's get knitting all right so one thing that we need here is a chair i don't know why i took away his previous chair but we are gonna go ahead and get another chair for our ziggy friend over here oh my god why the legs no 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 don't lag on me don't my god oh crap okay fine we'll just work through the freaking leg for now all right so let's see a nice rocking chair could be great for our ziggy over here because you know he is into knitting and i feel the best chair for knitting must be a rocking chair now here's a lovely rocking chair put that one on an angle there okay now i also forgot to mention that i fixed his fence we didn't really have a proper fence for ziggy yet and i also continued the fence for cypress and also for beatrice when we play with them i really do apologize for the lag like this no oh my god no it's because of for rent i feel it's the fact that we have apartments here that's what's making the game lag so much i'm so freaking sorry all right i just want to get some lovely plantations in here while we have a little money i did make money off camera i don't know if i want to do that <laughs> That's a little bit too much. Maybe these curtains could do. I really cannot stand the lag. Like, I I also really don't want to restart my game. I know it's not gonna help with anything because it's the apartments, okay? I swear it's the apartments that's giving me a little bit of shit right now. I'm just gonna make a cute little knitting nook here for our knitting friend. Okay, with the rest of the money that we have left, I would like to add a few more accents to this house. You know, I actually kind of like this rug here take away that rug. I wonder if I'm actually just gonna give Ziggy a little TV that can stand here somewhere so that they can knit and watch TV at the same time maybe. I really do apologize for the lag. I really really hate it. All right so we have a little table over here. Now we can have one of these TVs. There we go. There's something for entertainment. I also want to get him another appliance for the kitchen because the kitchen is a little bit empty looking still. I don't know why but I feel like Ziggy would be into ice cream cream and waffles. Is it just me? I don't know. Okay, this is what I did so far. We have this little table over here and well, the rest of the things here, some miscellaneous objects. I feel like this would suffice for a dining slash chilling place slash kitchen. All we need to finish up now is basically his bedroom and the bathroom. I just want to quickly see what Yarny is up to. Yeah, the cat's name is Yarny. Yarny has defeated a wild squirrel. Okay, Yarny has been sprayed by a skunk. Okay. Yarny, come home. Oh my gosh, I need to remember to put down pit bowls. Oh my gosh, I can't believe I forgot about that. So we can have a pit bowl here and maybe a scratching post. We can put a little bed over here for the kitty cat. All right, Ziggy, I want you to fold that up. All right, we still have a little bit of lag going and I did clear the notification panel. Oh, okay, no, there we go. That is much smoother. All right, so Yarny, you are stinky. Oh my gosh, let's maybe pet you over there. Oh yeah, Yarny got sprayed by a skunk. 
I remember. All right, we really need to go to the bathroom. Seems like we do have a bath. No, why would you use a bush if you have a toilet? Go inside. It is actually very exciting to know that we have two sims left after Ziggy. We really need to get into knitting already, but we do need to take care of our needs first. And I'm thinking maybe we can make some waffles. I've never really seen sims use the waffle maker. So I would love to see that interaction. All right, so we're opening the waffle maker, putting in some batter. Okay. Cook Cooking is unpalatable. No, I suppose you can hate cooking. Aziggy, I don't know. If you think you hate it, then you can hate it. I don't know. Okay, so you can do other things while it's cooking by the looks of it. I'm pretty sure that green light will shine a bit. Oh, there we go. Let's collect the waffles. Oh, look how beautiful that is. Oh my gosh. Heart-shaped waffles. Why is it in your inventory? Grab a, grab a serving. Hey, <laughs> don't eat the waffles. Oh my gosh. Look at, did you see that jump? I didn't know cats could jump that far in The Sims. That's incredible. It looks nice. You know, even though it's already half eaten, it, it still looks very, very nice. I'm wondering how much money we will get for selling waffles. Although that's not in Ziggy's expertise. Maybe with Beatrice, we can check that out. Um, Yeah, we have to get to knitting. Oh my gosh, they're expensive to make. All right, we need a little bit of money somehow. Is there anything over here we can grab and sell? Yeah, we do. We have these My Sims characters that we can take. I will take take two of those put them into the inventory here and stock it i don't suppose anything annoys me more than seeing this you know wasting food you serious i know it's a game i know it's pixels you cannot give those food to real life people but seriously it's a waste of money in the game at least you know look how good it looks though actually but that's just disgusting like oh hey we have a customer you're gonna buy our cute little mice some dolls this is yuki and it's yuki number two i haven't seen shrek arena in a while oh hey we have we have somebody over you can go home though because i'm busy oh hey look there's beatrice beatrice came to hopefully buy a doll from us what is our price is this maybe just do 100 percent. we don't need a lot of money here okay sweet we sold one maybe we can sell the other one. Oh my god this lag i'm not used to this lag i do not like it actually you know i am actually used to playing the sims in the most laggiest of laggy but in those times i had a horrible computer i was playing the sims 1 the sims 2 and i was very young and i loved the game so much that i just didn't care about the game lagging at all i was just excited to play the sims okay i don't want to make this whole episode about me going on about the lag like this is not how my game is supposed to run but it is because of the apartments i'm pretty sure of that let's knit clothing no let's do objects let's maybe do rugs i can't believe we already achieved something here oh cool achieve level four knitting skill knit while listening to music that can that's not a problem sell a knitted object on plopsy Okay, you know, I'm never gonna sell anything on Plopsy because there you wait a year and a half for something to get sold and oh my god, our cat needs a litter box. Okay, sweetie, I don't think we can afford one right now oh we can we can do this oh yay it's so cheap as well 25 bucks okay there you go kitty you have a poopy box <gasps> ziggy why did you stop please continue that rug continue the rug oh my god can do you want to continue it on the bed he just totally does not want to continue the freaking knitting work like why why not continue Continue it. Oh, come on, Ziggy. We paid 60 bucks to make that rug and we don't we don't really have a lot of money, bro. I have reset him and everything by now. Nothing works. You know what, Kitty? I would appreciate it if you went out and find us some feathers, you know, like that would be very helpful. What's this over here? Ooh, I'm wondering if our cat got this. I'm gonna take that for ourselves, you know, because that might have been our cat. I do not know. I see you can actually send your pets to explore, but you need to have trained them to level three on something. You're gonna fall off of their silly cat. Ziggy, will you please do that for us now? Resume. He just totally refuses to do shit right now, Ziggy. Oh my god. Is it because you're sleepy? Like, you're not even that tired, but maybe take a nap. Okay, so we had a power failure. A lot of our things broke. Do you really think I'm in the mood to fix any of these items right now? I just really want Ziggy to continue the freaking thingy over there. Because we don't have enough money to start something new, do we? Okay, though, we do. Let's maybe try the cactus. Oh, that you want to do. You're, you're just really not in the mood to knit a rug, are you? I don't think you are. I'll get to fixing these items 
soon. It's just I'm just not now in the mood to do it. We really need to focus on making money. All right, so luckily we could finish this thingy over here. Whoops, put it in there. Uh, sell that for 37. There's no way that I'm selling that for 37 because I spent 30 bucks to make it and I don't have a different way of selling it except for Plopsy. Oh, well. Let's just sell it for 37 then. Such a waste. Well, right. Anyway, let's maybe try and repair some of these objects here because this is just annoying now. And Yarny keeps getting sprayed by a skunk. I don't know what's happening. <laughs> Where is Yarny even? Oh, you're here? Are you gonna wash yourself? Because I know we can't wash you, you're a kitty cat. Oh yeah, I forgot about this upgrade part over here. We can sell this upgrade part, maybe for a decent amount of money, and this one as well. I'm so glad we didn't get electrocuted yet. Brilliant, we're doing good. Oh, we got some more upgrade parts. Ooh, oh, that's five simoleons, ten simoleons. We're gonna try and sell them anyway. We can't really make any progress if we can't knit, you understand? So we gotta find some different ways to do things now and then as well. I also learned about the frog term in knitting, which basically means you take apart a project of some kind to reuse its yarn. And I didn't know that. Okay, so our cat is helping us to scavenge for some parts that we can probably sell. <gasps> 90. Oh, that's a good one. All right, so the next day we can go ahead and try selling those upgrade parts. What? Is there still something I need to fix? What? What do I need to fix? Is there something of someone else? else that I can fix to fix that problem. I suppose we could maybe try and repair poor Beatrice's fridge of- Hey, who just went in there? That's not nice, that's not your tent. Like, we we, we, we did this for Beatrice, but it doesn't seem to work at all. Oh, Ziggy can't get in there. I locked the gate. All right, let's see if we can get anything sold today. Ah, I'm so sorry for doing this all the time, but I really cannot stand the lag anymore. Oh, wait, I don't think we can start the yard sale because of this freaking thing going on over here, right? I swear to God, if this doesn't work to get rid of that freaking thingy, then I'm really gonna be pissed because um, we gotta make money, you know? Maybe we can get some upgrade parts from doing this as well, you know? That would be cool. Ah! Sweet. Okay, let's scavenge for parts. Okay, you know, Ziggy almost died there just now. That was kind of scary. Let's maybe get some leftovers. Hey, no scratchy. The furniture. Lecture about scratching. I gave you a scratching post, you freaking cat. Ziggy, you know you could have finished your food before stocking the table, right? But oh well, that's okay. All right, so let's try this again, maybe. Well, well, well. If it isn't Shrek Arena, we were just gossiping about you, girl. For those who don't know, Shrek Arena is a lovely sim created by the Gamer Bear 76 Awesome content creator. Better go ahead and subscribe there if you have the chance. Well, we already made 504. I'm literally just sitting here watching the sims buy the upgrade parts while I'm eating my Sunday pudding. So yeah, I'm, I'm just enjoying myself here and keeping note of how many money we're making. Oh, and if you're wondering what I'm having, I'm having what we call Sahu. In English, you might say Sago or Sago. They go, but we call it Sahu. We pronounce the G as a kh, so yeah. Uh, hey Cypress, you beautiful specimen, how are you doing? I haven't seen you in a long, long time. We don't have near as enough money for continuing our bathroom or our bedroom. Well, we can buy a shower of 300 and then we have 200 bucks left to maybe, well, paint and tile the bathroom. So I think the 500 bucks here is actually gonna help us with only the bathroom. Okay, we made another 30. I really want to sell this upgrade part. That is worth 120. I'm hoping we'll get a lot of money for it to sell it by 200%, you know. <gasps> she bought it for 360. Oh, that is beautiful. Let's maybe sell the rest of these parts. You know what? I'm going to end this yard sale. I'm going to sell these two remaining parts manually. And I think this might do it to finish our house. Get rid of that old bed and get a brand new one. How about this? Oh, that's a little bit too pricey-ish. Uh, maybe this one. This one is 300 bucks. This one of 300. Oh my gosh, I didn't know that Lovestruck gave us one of these showers as well. Oh my god, that is so nice. Okay, we have four lavender bushes here. <laughs> to finalize the pathway, I suppose. But yeah, that means our money is caputo. I really wish this is something I remember to do with 
every house from the beginning but i decided on doing a little tour of each house before going over to the new character so over here we have our lovely little yellow kitchen with some appliances over here we have our little knitting nook and our cat made a little boo-boo over there but that's all right um here is this thingy over here well it's not much to show but you know it's something over here we have our lovely little bedroom can you believe that this item over here is 10 simoleons i didn't know it was that cheap i really need to maybe add curtains here but i will add that off camera and over here we have our bathroom which also needs a curtain i will also add that off camera and yeah we have a shower and a toilet but okay you guys that means we are finally finished with ziggy by the next episode we will be randomizing between beatrice and cyprus our last remaining characters for this challenge well challenge let's play basically but alrighty i hope you guys enjoyed this video thank you so much for watching i hope to see you all in the next one